The next technique is the phase displacement control. The voltage control can be obtained by using multiple inverters and summing the output voltages of inverters. A single phase bridge full wave inverter can be perceived as sum of two half wave bridge inverters. A 180 degrees displacement produces an output voltage shown in the figure. Whereas a delay angle of beta or displacement angle beta produces an output as shown here then the RMS output voltage V0 equals to Vs square root of beta by pi. Let it be equation number one. If V a naught equals to sigma n one three five two infinity two V S by n pi sine n omega t and V B one naught equals to sigma n one three five two infinity two V S by n pi sine n of omega t minus beta. Instantaneous output voltage. That is VAB equals to VA0 minus VBO. That equals to sigma n1352 infinity 2 Vs pi n pi of sine n omega t minus sine n of omega t minus beta. Let this be equation number 2. Since sine A minus sine B equals to 2 sine a minus b by 2 cos a plus b by 2. Now, by using this formula, if we simplify this, then we are going to get v a b equals to sigma n 1352 infinity 4 b s by n pi sine n beta by 2 cos n of omega t minus beta by 2. Let it be equation number 3. Now, the RMS value of fundamental output voltage V1 equals to 4 Vs divided by root 2 of sine beta by 2. That is equation number 4. Now, this equation indicates that the output voltage can be varied by varying the delay angle beta. This type of control is useful for high power applications requiring a large number of transistors in parallel. This is regarding phase displacement control for voltage control of an inverter. If this video is useful, please like, share, subscribe and comment. Thank you.